All right. Adding to mine and my partner's correlation of feedback and statistics of the drinking age being over to 18, uh, I've collected some more information to express to you guys. Um, according to Chuck Hurley, an associate with uh, MAD, uh, Mothers Against Drunk Driving, said that the answer is not lowering the age to 18. It would increase the availability of alcohol to even younger adults. And guess what happens in high school? Literally the trickle-down approach. He also said, that the inconvenient truth is that the tr is that a drinking age of 18 would cause more funerals. 900 families a year would have to bury another teenager. Um, he, my opponent, talked about uh, the law pushing teens away and uh, pushing teens away to drinking and everything. Um, that's not necessarily true. Um, if any law would push people to do the opposite, then probably half the world would be dead. Um, if um, wow. Yeah, big time. Okay. The average, the average age, he also stated that um, bringing the age down to 18 will help teenagers uh, know their limit of drinking. Well, actually, the average age of the first drink in the U.S. for uh, people are the age of 15 years old. So if they're already starting to drink at the age of 15, they cannot know their limit by the time they're 18 or 21. It's, I mean, it's simply just called self-control. Uh, according to Alexander uh, Wagner, who, is, uh, who I stated in a, a previous speech, uh, did a study in 1998 and uh, states that 52% of high school seniors uh, in the United States drank in the last month. So if the age is lower to 18, think about that percentage, how much it would increase because all those high school students would most likely be have availability to the alcohol. Also, he stated that uh, he took a national survey nine years later and indicated that 96% of the public remains concerned about teen drinking. The 21 age law clearly does not eliminate youth uh, drinking, but it is one important component uh, for an effort to minimize uh, youth drinking problems. According to uh, the Nation uh, Research Council, in an article reducing underage drinking and collective responsibility, uh, stated that the number one drug in America is alcohol and more young people die from alcohol related uh, causes than any other illicit drug combined. Now, keeping the age to 21 is just like keeping the age of driving uh, to 16. Uh, they tried to pass that to 18 and it didn't pass. But you have to wait to get your driver's license. You have to wait to get your permit. It's a privilege to have a driver's license, just as it is a privilege to uh, drink when you're um, um, 21 of age. So, in a sense, everything is there for a reason. Every single rule and law that the United States gives is for a reason, and is most most of the time for the safety of the uh, American citizens. So, pretty much. I would say wait till you're 21 and do what you do with everything else, use it but don't abuse it.